Howdy y'all, I'm around the wheel. You're watching the Neo Win Mix introduction pack, and we're almost done with basic training. I think we've got three levels left, starting with this one, which is Fancy Fencer, in which I think we can assume safely, I suspect, that we may be doing some fancy fencing today. Ten lemmings, gotta save them all. Probably gonna do that uh, one fencer, fencer, one fencer goes through the whole thing kind of deal, like combining the tasks like we did last time. That's my guess, anyhow. Uh, we're just thrown straight into this one. Two builders. Yeah, this one is pretty straightforward. It looks like two diggers. Okay, we're gonna have to we're gonna have to get down with the frame stepping sickness to figure this one out. I don't think necessarily we need the floater. Uh, maybe that's just for peace of mind because I think what we well no I bet no we will need it because he's gonna turn around and hit. Yeah. He's going to build from here. How far does this go to the... Yeah, he's going to turn around and hit the thing. So he does need to be a floater. So we need to get this in such a way. Alright, we need to kind of line this up. This is going to be a pretty easy level. This is just testing... Ooh, I like the animation on the exit there. The, the orbit of the sun and the moon. I love it. Very cute. You're watching Lemmings, Ultra Sun, and Ultra Moon. So, we gotta get down... Okay, so if we go here... I'm gonna guess if we go from about here... That's going to give us a good bead on... Eh, maybe not. Okay, yeah. I can see lines going up the build. So I think that one is gonna be safe. So I think we got about where we need to with that. Alright. And then... One more time... Okay, so he's going to go up and over the way. That's why we need him to be a floater. So there he goes. And he's coming back across the way. Alright, so here we go. Going to dig now through the bookshelf with the skull in the top. It's a nice little bit o deco ration. So let's see. How far up... How far up is this going to go here? We need, to, we need to see our line of sight here. Our line of sight is going to take us to about... Okay, he's gonna go... Yeah, gonna go up there. So we need to start digging about here. Or we need to end our dig about here, I think. Let's go ahead and start and see if we've gotten it. If not, we can always just back it up. No, I think we may have come down a little too soon there. Put that thing back in your backpack, sir. Not just yet. I think maybe a few more pixels down will get it. Okay. Looks like that might be it right there. I'm seeing I'm seeing some good times. Okay. If we get super close up there. That looks like it should do it right there. That will ultra do it. I'm going to start fencing. So he's going to go ahead and hit turn back around probably. Yeah. He's going to be the last one by a long shot it seems like. But I think we can call that He's still going, right? Okay, yeah, good. Still shoveling. Still shoveling the walk. Very good, very nice. Alright. Up through. Ooh, yes. Just barely, but it counts. Good going. Very nice. Looks like they're all safe and going to the exit. So that was a pretty easy solve. Wonder if we're gonna be learning anything else, or if it's just or if this is the final the final test here. Let's let's treat ourselves to a little cauliflower salad and olive oil. As a reward for making it through. There we go. There's our athlete in the back. Very good. That was a pretty simple one. I enjoyed that one. Very nice. Okay. Not too much there going on except reifying concepts that we have already learned. Let's go ahead and move on while we've got the quickness with us here. Equal distribution. 20 lemmings. Must save 22. Each exit will only take 11 lemmings. And we've got the pickup skills. So moving on ahead. Be informed here that cloned skills like builders or miners also have a skill shadow. Also, you might want to wait a few frames before cloning certain skills. For example, a cloned miner creates a smaller tunnel if cloned slightly later. Ugh. That sounds like it could get ugly, but let's see how it goes here. Everybody is safe for now, so I can kind of... We have climbers. We sure do. We have climbers and floaters, as a matter of fact. So we're going to get up into... Where are we going to get up into? Do we have... F 
fencers to help us here. No, but we have shimmiers. That is... Okay. So we're going to go ahead and do climber and clone. We're going to do one side first. We can do both sides separately, it would seem. Alright, so we've got our shimmier going here. So we're going to assign that. And what did we pick up there? I, I missed the count. That was a builder that we got there. Okay. Alright, so... All right, we're going this away. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Not, not quite, sir. There you go. This one I think is gonna need to be a floater because he's gonna climb across the way here. All right, so he's gonna drop off there and get the miner going. All right, we're gonna have to build our way in. Actually, let's go ahead and we're going to do some backup here. I think I see now what we need to do elsewhere. Okay. Alright, we're going to take that to here. We're going to take that to the streets. Very nice. And yeah, we're going to need this one to be a floater. So that's why we have two floaters. We're going here with this. And we're going to... There we go. Very good. Okay, so once we drop onto here... Alright. We're going to go... All right, this is going to get a little interesting. Let's see about it. Just going to kind of play this one out by ear. This side is safe to do on its own at a later point because we have infinite time. Okay, so starting off going like this, I'm going to go ahead and go a little bit forward. So that it's easier for a builder to hit there. Alright. Alright, so he's going. There we go, yeah. So we've got distinct tunnels going on here. Well, that could serve to be a problem now because I... No? Well, yeah, I only have two builders. Okay. Okay, we could do it like that. And then, yeah, we could just do one builder to the... Okay, no, we have two builders to pick up. Okay, so that will be solved toward the end. No, I messed that I messed that mine up. Okay, dang it. Okay, hold on. Okay. All right, now keep going. Okay, so he's going to get caught in right there. Okay, I think that's more of what I want right there. But, okay, he only goes so far, though, I think. Yeah, he's going to hit that and then come. Okay, so I need to back it up even farther. Okay. So we want to come from about... Probably as soon as we get the thing, right? That's probably a wise decision. Okay, there we go. All right, and floater for you and shimmier for you. Okay, bring it on back. Okay, now it's back to... Okay, he just climbed up into there and did... Okay, that's fine. That should be fine. In fact, we didn't need the floater if he did that, so... Alright. Sure, fine, whatever. Alright, so we're gonna go... We're gonna go a few steps forward from here. Alright. So if I clone from here... Aha! There we go. There is the step we need. We can get it going pretty evenly here. Okay, so we've got two... Alright, we're gonna do this... Once again, I think. All right, now you're going to come in from the other side. Yeah, you're going to come in from the other side. So that you can get us the skills we need. You need to be a shimmier. All right, bonk. And bonk. Okay, one builder for getting right to here. Ooh, I'm going to have to do this exactly correctly. Maybe I want to get this set up first, but I think we can maybe come from about here. I'm doing this without the sh without a shadow, so this is a little bit inefficient, but maybe if I do this right, I can get it to work. No, he's just a little too low for it, I think. Yeah, he's a little low there. I'm going to try to get it to work without a shadow, but that may not be doable. I'm going to come from about here. Yeah, I should have done this earlier and 
gotten that shadow going and then gotten this one going. Okay, yeah, so maybe need a climber coming out here on the other side to get everything. And then we have the last builder to get them up to one or the other of the exits. Although maybe... Maybe I was wrong to use a cloner down here. I gotta go sort this out. There's a few things I'm doing wrong here, I know. Okay, now I have both my bridges set up already. And I'm gonna have... I haven't used any cloners yet. Okay, and you shimmy over this way. Alright. I think that may be okay to do for now. Let's see, though. We do need at least one lemming to pick up the builders. So he's gonna come in and... Yeah, so we're going to get one more builder, which we need to clone here to get each lemming to the number of exits. Okay, half the lemmings have to go in one exit, half have to go in the other. So, yeah, that's what we have this last builder for. Okay, so I need to start in a spot where he mines down successfully, like right here. And then I need to clone again another such spot which is pretty close to happening let's see about it okay if he does that there okay he settles in a little okay no like right from the beginning is where we want to do that and i think they can i sh think they should be able to step up to that i'm gonna go ahead and get him building to the exit now I think I can afford to do that. And I'm going to go ahead and make both of these guys the floaters. Because they're going to have to go up a wall and then not shimmy their way back. They're going to have to each go down the wall here. Oh, jeez. I should have started that from way... From way sooner, actually. Uh, one of them's not going to make it. In fact, neither of them are going to make it. Ooh. Ooh. Terribly unsuccessful. Okay, so... Ooh, we need to back that way up then. Okay, so I need to... So I need to go from about... I think maybe I can afford to go from farther... No, I can't afford to go from farther back. So maybe I need to do my bridges differently? Okay, yeah, you get through there. And then you get there. Okay, this is gonna be... Yeah, tough to do. Maybe I should have positioned one of these bridges a little lower. Let's try that. All right, we've got our position right here. Let's start, and then let's go down a little bit. No, that's still too close. But yeah, that was too close, because last time I got that far, and then he chopped through the bridge at the edge. This is going to take some real doing. Maybe what I want to no, it wouldn't make sense to build two bridges up the way and then three because you need to get both of them into different exits. So yeah, this is still too close. Ah, this is hard to manage. Okay, here we go. I'm not sure how I managed it this time, but I did it anyway, so it's got to be pretty perfect. Clone just as soon as you start and then clone those two and then... They just barely reach. I don't know why they didn't reach the first time. I guess I was a little too low or something. But I'm not entirely sure what the difference was. But it works here. See, they both each go to an exit. And so these guys are going to climb back up a wall and float. They should chip through there. That's not going to work. They're not going to get up that one. So the bridges have to be pretty much the exact height. God, this is a rude level. Okay, yeah. Because see, they're going to go up in there. Okay. Okay. Both your bridges have to be exactly right. You have to mine at the exact right time. You have just enough space to get here. This is a tight level. Holy cats. There. Is it good enough now, your majesty? Jesus. Okay, they're going through. They're each chipping through their bridges. I think that's going to make it this time. Holy mother. What a precise level. They get up there and they cross to there. They get up there and they cross to there. That's ten apiece with the floater preserving each climber. Woo, golly! That level demanded some precision, let me tell you now. That was that was quite the little quite the little nightmare scenario. Let's go ahead and skip to the end of that. 
Looks like they're saying a little how do you do, crossing each other on their way into each one. We did it. 22 lemmings rescued, 22 accounted for, and I think we have enough time to go to the last level of basic training, which is going to be Special Staircase. One lemming. Gotta save him. That's usually the case when you have one living. The fact that walkers can interrupt most skills at any point leads to a lot of possibilities. Builders and platformers can be stopped early to cut them short. Interrupting stackers can get you to a higher place instead of creating a wall. The most interesting thing is the interruption of miners, bashers, and fencers. By interrupting them mid-stroke, when they have not fully carved out the new tunnel part, you can create new ways to step higher. Try all of this out and observe. Mastering this will be of great benefit, which means it's going to be used a lot later. I think I know how to speak this game's language by now. Let's try it out. Okay, so we've got six walkers. We're going to be going... Let's see. Okay, so it looks like we're going to be fencing our way up here, mayhap. Uh, we don't want to walk into this trap, obviously. But let's see where... Where does this get us? Okay, that gets us up here. That's pretty... Seems pretty simple to me, unless we want to make him a climber as well. But, okay. I'm going to go ahead and fence here for now. Uh, seems like this could be... This could be bad news later, but I'm going to use this here for now. Okay, so it looks like what we want to do here is... Okay, we have no way of... We have no way of swimming across this uh, water pit. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to build... And that's going to be the first of our walkers. There we go. Up into there. Then we want a platform across. But we want to cut the platformer off. Okay, I'm seeing it. I'm getting it. Okay. There we go. Into the gap. Now a builder probably right here. And same deal here. Okay. Alright. Oh no. I think maybe we want to do the weird bashing thing in this case. That might be... No, I, pff, I didn't want to bash there. Good grief. I wanted to walk there. Okay. Alright, so, yeah. We're gonna want to, I guess... Okay, we have a miner and a basher. That's not gonna get us... That's not gonna get us very high up, I don't think. There's no steel, is there? No, we would have wanted to use our fencer here, probably. Okay, let's back it up. Let's back this up. So, I think what we want... So, do we want to use a miner here? really okay okay if we mid stroke here aha there we go oh <laughs> wow okay that's that's mighty impressive okay then let's see how we want to do this okay we're definitely gonna have to build over this and platform over this so we're gonna have to bash in a way probably um that's not high enough to bash through though um, we don't want to use a stacker here. And how many pixels high is this? I'm going to fence real quick and see how many pixels high this is. Will he just walk right over that? Is that something I need to... No, he won't walk over that. That's probably where the stacker is needed. Do we want to... Where do we want to fence to... Or do we want to, in fact, mine somewhere? We might have to use things in places that seem kind of odd. The miner seems about right. Uh, everything else I'm struggling with a little bit, though. This is too high to bash over. And I think we're going to need our fencer in here to mine up to here. So I don't really know. Was this small enough? or No, this is the same kind of deal. Yeah, this is the same thing where it's too... Well, hold on. Oh, no, okay, it's not too low to do that over. Okay, yeah, because the, the pixel column, the ceiling. So, yeah, we're going to use a basher and a miner here. Okay, and yeah, and then we're going to stack up to... We're going to stack up a few pieces. Doesn't have to be very many. Okay, so now... Now comes figuring out how to use our fencer in a handy-dandy way. Alright, and then the builder. Okay, only one thing left to figure out, and that's the fencer. Okay, so we're not going to fence all the way through this, obviously. This is going to be kind of like the basher thing. Okay, I'm getting it, I'm getting it, I'm understanding. I am 
I am in full comprehension now. Okay, so what we want to do is stop fencing at a point where it would allow him to walk up. And that's going to be... where? About right... Okay, that's too far. So, a little bit before that. Nope, nope, right about here. Yes! <laughs> oh, oh, the jank is real. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh, that's a funny level. Uh, but yeah, actually using that as a skill, that's going to get uh, really wild. But I think we're going to stop there for now because I believe that is it as far as basic training. I think there are 21 levels in basic training. Let me check that real quick just to be sure. No, 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 no. There is one more. You're getting a little preview of it here. There's one more at least. I, But I think this is the last one. Uh, and we will go ahead and do this tomorrow as our or next time. Never want to say tomorrow. You never want to really promise anything here on round the wheel industries a limited liability concern but yeah we will we will save this last basic training level for next time and then we will use it to segue into advanced training i think this is well and truly the last one let me do a quick check yeah that's it okay stepping up to the stars and then that's it we will do this and then next time it's on to the real the real big boy stuff